what's up guys welcome back to my channel happy friday the weekend is officially here you guys i hope you guys had an amazing week a productive week a positive week i hope you guys have a great and positive day a productive day finish the week off strong you guys so you guys can enjoy your weekend and relax and unwind and reset uh you guys if you haven't seen my review for scream go and check that out i went to go see it last night and it's better than what i expected so go on over there's no spoilers um i won't be giving any spoilers i want you guys to go and enjoy that for yourself oh you guys i don't know about you but i feel like i had an extremely long week last weekend i was um hanging out with one of my girlfriends i was away for a few days and that was pretty refreshing so i came back with a just a fresh mindset y'all so anyway you guys today i just want to talk to you guys about just you know staying focused and you know not derailing from the things that you want to do not derailing from you know your goals i know sometimes we go through a lot you know we're going through times right now where anxiety is high depression is high um fear is high you know uncertainty is high and i'm a big believer in being aware but not being afraid and you know it's it's two different things there's a line between that you know and without going too much into it, i just want you guys to just always be aware of your surroundings always be aware of energy always being you know aware of what you're watching what you're reading what's going on around you what's going on around your family but it's so important to definitely be aware but not afraid because we still have a life to live. As long as we are breathing, as long as we are walking this earth, as long as we still have jobs and family and friends and things to do, we've got work to do. We have got work to do, you guys. So I want you guys to kind of keep that in mind. Remind, remind yourselves sometimes that, look, although there's this going on and that going on, and there's this going on out there and in here, you know, the end of the day i can't be so afraid that i paralyze myself in fear and i stop doing the things that i need to do in my life whether it's taking care of family whether it's being a parent whether it's being a spouse a significant other your duties don't stop as a human um you know just because things are happening around you especially things that you really honestly can't control um, so I want you guys to just kind of keep that in mind. You know, we, we as humans tend to give in to that fear, give in to anxiety, give in to uncertainty and the fear of uncertainty. And we just kind of pile those things on on top of each other to the point where we just explode and we don't know what to do with, with ourselves and we're just an emotional mess. Um, and that's no way to live. That is no way to live, you guys. We've got goals. We've got dreams. We've got things that we want to do. We've got families that we need to take care of. You know, we've got to do better at being, you know, humans in general. But if you've got work to do personally and within you, like if you have work to do as a significant other, if you've got work to do at being a better friend, a better sister, a better brother, a better um, aunt, uncle, a better mom, a better dad, whatever it is, you've still got work to do and there's healing to be done and there are goals to be attained so um i want you guys to just focus on those things you know don't allow um outside interferences and um the chaos and the mass hysteria of you know things going on to paralyze you in fear to where you completely crawl into a shell and that's it for you you know you've got to stay on top of your health mentally and physically and emotionally in order for you to do what you have to do to get closer to your goals so with that being said you guys i just want you guys to focus on that um again you know be aware but not in fear you know um and it's easier said than done for some you know some some people go through things where um you know they been an anxious person all their life or they've been a big you know worry person or they worry about any and every little thing so when things get out of hand or it's things that they can't control you know things can get a lot worse but that's why you know it's it's really 
it's so how can I say it's such an honorable thing to know when people go finally seek help and just because you go see a counselor or a therapist or someone who can kind of help you who who is an expertise in mental health your mental health is more important than anything okay and to be honest with you I remember a time where seeking you know a therapist made you feel like you were crazy or made other people feel like you were crazy I do not make it a secret that I have seen a therapist I still see a therapist because I need you know all the help that I can get to make sure that I'm okay and not that there's anything wrong but there's nothing wrong with therapy there is nothing wrong even if you're going through the most minor thing and you don't know why seek a counselor seek a therapist there's nothing wrong with that you guys because there's so much going on in the world right now that is catching people's mental health and snatching it away that honestly you need people in your corner who are going to help you get through things mentally whether it's friends family a therapist a pastor whatever you need to talk to someone don't go through mental health issues alone without any help i can't stress that enough i went i i feel like maybe past you know situations um you know i i seeked counsel from um you know church but you know i believe um that god uses people and god gives people gifts and those gifted people are some of the best therapists out there um so that is a resource that is a resource that is given to us so we can help each other out and help ourselves mentally so we're not out here losing our minds so with that being said you guys i'm not going to continue going um other than that you guys i know yesterday i didn't game because i went to go watch uh scream so i will be doing that tonight also today i will be getting my third laser skincare treatment so i'm gonna let you guys know what that was like um probably not today but tomorrow because i'm gonna be a little agitated after i get it done um but i will be gaming today now another thing i was thinking about was um, starting another game not in place of this one but playing two games at the same time um you know maybe one day playing resident evil 2 remake and then the next day you know every other day playing something different or playing both in the same day so um i'm looking to play another horror game you guys um so if you can leave a few games down below that you guys would love to see me play i'll also post a little something on my comment section on my um community section so you guys can kind of let me know you know how you feel about that and what you want to see me play so with that being said you guys i hope you guys have a fabulous Friday and I hope you guys have a great weekend ahead if you haven't done so please subscribe to my channel hit like share and don't forget to hit the notification bell so you guys can get notified whenever I pop up on your feed I'll see you guys later Toodles.